Today, let us take you to one of the most unbelievable mega projects ever built and complete in China. And with that said, in this video, get ready to witness the most breathtaking super engineering works of China Laos mega projects from construction to completion. But before we get started, be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell for you to see the latest updates of our channel. From construction to finish, brace yourself to witness the most breathtaking super engineering works of China Laos mega projects. The closure of the main section of the Yuanjiang Railway Bridge is complete. This bridge is considered one of the more challenging projects on the China Laos Railway. The bridge girder spans 249 meters, which is a world record. It is designed to be 832.2 meters long and supported by six piers, with the tallest standing at 154 meters. With a total length of over 1,000 kilometers, the line will be put into operation by the end of 2021. After the train service is launched, Visitors will be able to take overnight trains to Vientiane, Laos from Kunming City in southwest China. With a maximum operating speed of 160 km per hour, trains running on the route will take passengers from Kunming to Vientiane in about 10 hours, including customs clearance time. With a length of 1,035 kilometers, the railway fully adopts Chinese technical standards and consists of two sections. Construction of the section in Laos from the border town of Bautin to Vientiane started in 2016, and construction of the China section of the railway linking the city of Yuqi and the border town of Mohan started in 2015. The China-Laos Railway is a strategic docking project between the China Proposed Belt and Road Initiative and Laos strategy to convert from a landlocked county to a land-linked hub. The project has been advancing steadily, with major tunnels already drilled through. Construction plans were changed to project the local environment reducing forest land occupation by more than 2.6 hectares. The project also includes plans to project migration corridors of wild animals along the route, such as elephants. The China-Laos Railway reached a key milestone after drilling through its 70th tunnel wrapping up a four-year construction of the key section. The completion of the 11.84-kilometer-long tunnel lays the foundation for the punctual opening of the railway in late 2021, which will connect southwest China's Kunming City to the Laotian capital of Vientiane. With a total length of over 1,000 kilometers, the China-Laos Railway will shorten traveling time between the two cities to half a day. After four years of hard labor, a tunnel under the China-Laos Railway project was successfully drilled ahead of schedule. Stretching 8.84 kilometers long, this single-hole double-track tunnel is named Heping, which means peace in Chinese. Meanwhile, the under-construction, 1,000-kilometer China-Laos railway line is expected to open to public in 2021. A 
7-kilometer-long tunnel along the China-Laos railway has been successfully drilled through in Laos. The tunnel passes the Luang Prabang Geological Suture Zone and multiple fault zones. Expected to stretch over 1,000 kilometers, the China-Laos Railway is the first overseas railway directly connecting China's domestic railway network. After years of construction, the railway linking southwest China's Kunming city with the Lao capital Vientiane became fully operational. <music> President Xi Jinping, General Secretary of the Communist Party of China, Central Committee and China's President, meet with the General Secretary of the Lao People's Revolutionary Party Central Committee and Lao President and jointly witness the opening of the China-Laos Railway. The China-Laos Railway was officially launched during a ceremony presided over by Lao President and Chinese President Xi Jinping. The landmark railway has seen Laos transform from a landlocked country to a land-linked nation, opening up new opportunities for trade and travel. President Xi said that following of the opening of the China-Laos Railway connecting China from Kunming to Laos in Vientiane capital, the mountains are no longer high and the roads are no longer lengthy. He said that from here on both sides must work together to build the railway into a path to riches and bring prosperity to both nations. The China-Laos Railway featuring tailored service is set to offer the passengers a fresh ride experience on a journey filled with rich cultural elements. The China-Laos Railway is slated to go into operation. The cross-border line will connect Kunming City of Southwest China's Yunnan Province with the Laos capital of Vientiane. The China-Laos Railway is also known as a Green Railway, as the design and construction of the railway have ensured the cross-border project would exert the least possible environmental impact. So, I hope you found this video wonderful, and if you did, be sure to like this video and don't forget to share this with others. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day!